What's going on, everybody? This is AZ Sports Cards back at it. Today's Thursday, and we have our mail video like usual, but instead of doing one package, I think we would just do two today. Just kind of feeling it. Uh, I want. I don't know. I don't know why. Just feeling two's always better than one, anyway. So we're gonna try that out. Our last mail we got was the Adolis Garcia. Nice card there. If he's doing really well this year, so I'm excited. We're gonna start with the smaller one first, and then we're gonna do a larger one. So, really don't know what these were. These been sitting for about two months now. So, we'll be going for the smaller one first. Hope everyone's having a fantastic Thursday. It was pretty good for me. We are on a three day weekend, so my weekend starts tomorrow. I think uh, that's gonna be really fun. Uh, I got some plans for this weekend. I'm going to a couple yard sales. One that said they had sports cards, so. Hopefully we can get some stuff there. And then I'm also going to check out some sports cards um, on Saturday, a giant lot. The guy said he wants a grand for it, so it looks pretty cool. I'm going to go check it out and see if we can work out a deal. So here's the first package. There we go. See what's in there. So looking at it, it looks pretty cool. I don't... Ah, okay. So glad we're doing two. So this is their card that they gave us. So Terry Boyd. We have big Boyd sports cards. The number one buyer and seller of sports cards and memorabilia. So there's his information. You want to hit him up for some cards. Pretty solid business card, I would say. Not as great as mine, but still. Awesome card. Uh, the card we have today, we have a nice Dan Duffy. Dan Duffy patch rookie from, I think, 2011. So I don't remember I paid. I think it was about 3 bucks. I think that sounds about right. Yep, 2011 from Bowman Sterling. So, nice card there. Solid. Solid looking card. Not a huge name player, but I think he was having a good stretch of games earlier on this month. Uh, I think he might have been either not leading in strikeouts, but definitely top five in either strikeouts or ERA or some other category. So, I picked him up pretty cheap. Not the craziest card in the world, but still beautiful. Very nice. Very nice card there. Yeah, I like the shine on it. I like the... Uh, Game used memorabilia. Does it say which game it's from? A refractor relic. Saying game used memorabilia. So it doesn't say which game, but still. Very nice card. Very sharp. Very cool. And it also says rookie relic in there. In the text. Rookie, yep. 2011 Bowman refractor. So still. Beautiful card. Really like that one a lot. So that's the first mail that we got we have another bigger package so maybe there's some crazier stuff in there we'll leave that on screen we'll probably put that right here in front of the jeter so very nice card i don't know why i wanted it to uh i think one would have kept it short and two i think is a good pick for us all right so we're gonna do another one too because <laughs> and i'm just getting some sleeves so psa authentic sleeves which is crazy because i've been able to find these at walmart pretty well so i think Kind of pull the trigger too soon on this. There, um, I think I picked these up after we went up to Buffalo to the Clarence Flea Market because we they couldn't get any of these. So I just thought maybe there's like a deficit, so I wanted to pick these up. So let me grab my mail bin and I will get a new package for us. Oh, fix Jeter real quick. As I throw it onto the Duffy. All right, one second. All right, real back real quick. Got another big size package here. I don't know when this one came in. I think this one came in May 5th. So about a month, month and a half ago. Slice that open. See what we got in here. I don't know. Uh, all the mail gets mixed up. So there's the inside. So maybe something cool. It looks tall. Looks like a tall package for a card. I really don't remember exactly what I found, what I got. So hopefully this is... Subconscious Adam or May Adam could have just picked up something solid. Ooh, as I just popped that out, it wasn't a, some cardboard. So I popped that out. Could, could this be something crazy? I don't know. Huh? I don't remember picking up something this long. So just trying to clear it out. So we got got the bubble wrap. Great packaging. We got a autograph of 
Carlos Rondon. Carlos Rondon. Uh, Rondon. Carlos Rondon. So, again, tons of baseball. I think he's another guy that was doing really well. I think this is also a Mercari buy. So, very nice. Very nice looking autograph on card. So let's take a look at that. So, again, tons of baseball. I'll have to put, put them both in the background. But very nice card there. We can focus in. Awesome. Carlos Rondon. On card auto. The surface is not that great. I might be smudging a little bit too, but if you take a look, if it focuses. There we go. Yeah, not that great of a surface. Scratch on it. But the card, the on card auto is really sweet. I really like that. It's a thicker card. I feel like it's made of glass, some glass layer on it. So I have a Strata autograph, Carlos Rondon, another guy who I think was doing pretty well, so I picked him up, did not have any of his uh, rookies or autos, so I picked this one up, I think from Mercari, uh, Mercari pretty cheap. I'll put all the prices in there in a, uh, at the end of the video, I'll put them in over the uh, cards, but still, solid card, really cool just to get some baseball. It's kind of, I'm kind of in that lull right now because there's, I mean, there's some football products coming out. I mean, Bowman, not Bowman Draft, um, Prism Draft and Score were coming out, and they're in the collegiate stuff still. And I kind of went kind of crazy buying autographs of potential players that are going to be superstars. So I might just wait until the season comes and then see who really shines and then pick them up. I know they're going to be cheap, uh, more expensive than right now, and now they'll be pretty cheap, but... I think that's going to be the right play in the long, in the long run. Instead of me just spending money to spend money. But still, beautiful card there. I really like that one. I really like both of them. I think this one is definitely a little better. It has a little scratch on his face. Probably nothing to get graded. Um, this material kind of gets a little dinged and damaged a little more than others. But very cool. Very cool card. So we got some two solid baseball. Two <laughs> pitchers, too. So... That is it for today. Thank you all for watching. This has been AZ Sports Cards, and I will see you all next time.